hello everyone uh, welcome back to my channel so in this video i'm just going to show you how you're going to upgrade um, your FortiGate uh, firewall device um, to the latest version upgrading FortiGate firewall um, your network devices security devices are very very important so that um, you don't be vulnerable to the latest attacks and all that so i'm just going to show you how you're going to do it and do it seamlessly you know there are some things you need to consider before you upgrade uh and also you know because of the platform builds and all that there are some things you need to see and check before you upgrade so let's dive in So here is my FortiGate um, device, and um, currently you can see I'm running FortiGate 7.2, and you can uh, simply see that it's saying this FortiGate is subject to a critical uh, security vulnerability. Immediate upgrade is recommended. You know, you might have a version that is lesser than this. I uh, urge you and advise you to upgrade to the latest uh, firmware. So let's just see the vulnerability that this has uh, that is Christ. So you can see 40. So he has uh, so coming here, we'll see that we have 40 OS and 40 pros the e power overflow in SSL VPN pre authentication. Now if we read all this, we'll see what the issue is and what uh, you need to do. So but we'll just need to upgrade. That's just uh, the bits of, of it. So in upgrading your device, uh, for the device, <clears throat> whether at bear, VM, and all that, you need to have access to the support portal, um, support where the Fortigit device is registered, you know, I want to be able to have access to it and be able to log into it because um, on the support portal is where you're going to download the image if you're not doing automatic automatic upgrade from the 40 gigs so let's log in first and let's see so i'm logging in to my device here um to <clears throat> the support portal so you know before you yeah so you have you need access to the support portal so you can download uh the vm where well, the vm uh the the image and all that but you know if you're using hardware uh whether you are using 11f 21f um 41f you know the hardware appliance one of the things you want to put into consideration is the upgrade parts uh this is 7.2.4 uh we have 6.4 6.4.4 6.8 then uh, 6.4.8 then we have 7.0 version 7.0 then now we currently have version 7.2 we have now you know the version 7.4.0 you, you understand so one of the things you want to do is to um check out the upgrade part before you upgrade your device so you, you have to go to document uh, docs.fortinet.com slash upgrade um dash two so when you enter that you are in your um in your in your browser it will bring you to this page so on this page um depending on the product you're using um uh, fortigate device you're using you can search out your fortigate device let's say you're on fortigate um uh, maybe 100 f so we have fortigate let's say 101 so 101 e 101 f let's say um four one four one e so i'm just saying that depending on the hardware appliance that you have in your environment you need to be able to validate the upgrade parts so that you can be able to systematically upgrade uh based on the upgrade parts you've uh, you've been given so let's take four one f for example so for four one f so you can see the current uh for today's version so from 6.4 to 
to 7.0 let's say your current version is on let's say 7. Point, um 7.0.9 and you want to upgrade to the latest version of 7.4.4 so yes and go so the uh, the recommended upgrade parts for this device would be uh from 7.0 you need to you need to download the 7.0.11 image and also download 7.2.6 image then download 7.4.1 image so for my own, uh, this is a VM, and I'm currently on 7.2.4, and I want to upgrade to 7.4.0. Uh, so let me check out my upgrade parts for for this. Let's say um, I have VM where uh, port gate VM. So the VM or uh, is on uh, VM where is a VM where so we have uh, is it yeah for skip vm then i'm currently on 7.4 7.2.4 and i want to go to 7.4 which one which is the latest version say go so here yeah, it means that from 7.2.4 i can upgrade directly to 7.4.1 so yes so all i need to do is just download the um, 7.4.1 image but if you're using another thing and it gives you more than that part you have to follow the part and download each so what i'll do is that there are two ways to do this so i can either go to my system then go to fab fabric management so under this fabric management we have um you can see this is the device we want to upgrade I click on upgrade then uh this is the next part next part to that um if i have my file i can you know just press and download so let's go to our uh, support so come into support come to services uh then no, support then firmware download So we have FortiGate VM. So this is FortiGate um, device. We have to choose the device which is FortiGate. Then select the download. When you select download, you will see some version 7.0. Then what we, the image we want to download is 7.4. Select the folder. Then we go to 7.4.1 so now coming to this place you will see a lot of um, device models and all that the only thing you want to do is to download the image that belongs to you so if you look at it this is uh for Ford gate 101 f this is for Ford gate 1001 e this is for Ford gate 1001 e so all these models uh, all these images are specified and specific to the to the models that they belong to so we're looking for the VMware, for the VMware ESXi. So, um, so for the gate VM, uh, this is what I'm going to download. This is what I'm going to download. So if you are just, um, if you just want to, you know, launch a VMware, you are going to use this, which is, uh, which has the extension of out o o u t dot o v e dot zip but i want to upgrade i have an existing um, firewall and i want to upgrade i'm going to download i'm going to download this uh which is the build for me to upgrade then the next thing is to click on the https and just start downloading so we have come to let's just wait for the download to finish all right so uh we are done uh, we are done downloading um the the image then you go to your firewall so on the firewall um, device you come to system uh fabric management and you go to uh you select the device you want to 
upgrade then click on the upgrade then um this can be an automatic upgrade but we want to do it manually come to file up, up, up uh, file upload then browse So this is the device, this is the build, then you open, okay, then confirm and backup config. So um, when you confirm and backup, the FortiGate device will automatically backup your config um, before, you know, before up upgrading it. So we started to upgrade our device. So let's wait for the device. So we can just continually ping, um, continually ping uh, the device so we can know when is back up. So <clears throat> Let's just wait.
Okay. I just save and continue. You can just disable this. Okay, I just save it. Let's show it again. Now we have our latest build. Uh, 7.4.1 so we don't have no longer have that notification that we can't uh that there's a vulnerable device or, or or anything like that so when it comes to um systems uh, you know uh, firmware come to this you can and check out all upgrades downgrades nothing so now you can see that our device see our device has been successfully upgraded to the latest firmware version thank you like and subscribe if